What's going on everyone? Ben Hess here with Adobe Stock and Epidemic Sound. And in this video, I'm gonna show you how to choose the right music for your project. Music plays such an important role in evoking emotion and feeling within the films and the stories that you're trying to tell which is why choosing the right music can make all the difference. If you played two completely different songs over the same footage, you're gonna get two very distinct outcomes. So today, I wanna to dive into three very useful tips on how to go about choosing the right music for your project. Tip number one, plan with music in mind. Before I start filming, I always like to do as much preparation as possible to make sure each project is successful. Along with looking up references for imagery and locations, I like to spend time researching songs that I can potentially use. This helps me not only get a list of songs that I think would fit the project and the story, but it can also inspire new ideas and creative ways of filming and can help shape the story that I'm trying to tell. Plus, this step is helpful to get everyone on board with how the final edit will sound, which if you're working with a big team of people can be extremely beneficial so everyone is on the same page. Sometimes I know the exact song I want, and other times I make a list of potential songs that I like. And then when I get to editing, I can make the final decision on what song I wanna use. And this leads me to tip number two, which is sorting by mood. One of the biggest mistakes I see so many people make is they immediately search by genre, thinking they know exactly what type of music they want. But I challenge you to take a step back and think about how you want people to feel when they watch your videos. Don't get so caught up in wanting to add a certain genre that you like. There could be so many other potential songs that you're missing out on that can convey a better mood than what you're initially thinking of. And using Adobe Stock Audio's wide range of filters, I'm able to choose precisely what mood or moods I'm going for. This can really help give you a creative spark and craft your videos to sound way better in the end. And you can still use genres in addition to using moods. I just highly recommend using moods as your primary way of searching. So let's look at a sequence I'm putting together for a running commercial. Looking at the footage, I know I'm gonna want something powerful since that's the mood that I'm trying to convey. So instead of going straight to a specific genre, which I might've went for a hip hop or a trap, I'm able to get a wide variety of songs that I wouldn't have picked otherwise. And these two songs I honestly would not have found because I would have been searching in the wrong areas. And this leads me to tip number three, which is look at the pacing and song structure. I always like to keep in mind the pacing of a song in relation to how I want my video to feel, which relates back to the mood that I just talked about. If I'm making a quick and upbeat commercial, I make sure to keep that in mind and set the tempo to a higher amount using the filters. But if I'm making a slower paced commercial where the shots are longer, I make sure to look for songs with a lower tempo. And when it comes to song structure, I like to look at the waveforms to see if I'll be able to easily edit or shorten a song to fit the proper length of my video. A lot of times I'm using anywhere from just 15 to 60 seconds of a song, so I like to make sure I'll be able to edit accordingly. For example, there might be a long intro I can take out, or I can shorten the chorus by half, or even end the song early but still have it feel complete. You have to take all of these things into consideration but the biggest by far is sorting by mood because you want your viewer to feel something after watching your video. And this goes for anything from a travel video, a music video, a commercial, a short film. Everything you're making will impact someone in one way or another. So to recap, plan your videos with music in mind. This can really help shape your videos and inspire your visuals before you even begin shooting. When finding a song, start by sorting with moods instead of genres. And last but not least, look at the pacing and song structure to help narrow down the best music for your project. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial, and if you have any tips yourself, drop them below so everyone can see them. See you guys on the next one.